Hey guys, what's up and welcome to my channel. I want to let you know up front that this video is sponsored by MarijuanaBreak.com. In this video, I am going to be discussing MarijuanaBreak.com and we'll be going to the website. I'll show you some things about it that are awesome. And that's basically it. I know that many of you, if not all of you, come here for cannabis product reviews, especially Florida medical cannabis reviews, and I want to let you know that my next video will be just the same as usual. Just decided to do a sponsored post so that I can pay my bills this month, that's all. But I'm gonna try to make this video fun and informative, and I want to let you know too that I would never take a sponsor that I don't believe in. I would never like talk about a company that I don't think is actually good for any amount of money. You know, like, I wouldn't, I can't. So some things to love about this website, MarijuanaBreak.com. It has tons of different articles that are really well written and well researched in my opinion. It has some videos on their website and there are a lot of cannabis infused recipes that I think, it, that I think that's really cool. I haven't personally tried any of their recipes myself. I have my gummy recipe that I love so much as you all know but but this website does have tons of different recipes so if you're into that and if you're looking for more cannabis recipes not at all limited to sweets and candies but this website has a bunch of savory cannabis recipes as well they literally have a recipe for vegetarian cannabis lasagna bro that's crazy I love lasagna plus they have their own reviews of various different cannabis related things like there are some dispensaries on there not Florida based dispensaries but most if not all of their articles are really really well written this site is like a treasure trove of articles blog posts and some instructional videos it even has a video and article about how to get your medical marijuana card in Florida specifically in Florida I thought that was really cool and I will link below the video and article that tells you how you can get your medical marijuana card in Florida and something else that I love about the site is you don't have to be an expert at all to understand the information in the articles that Marijuana Break has. The way that they're written gives you all the information that you need right there so that you can actually, so that you can really learn whatever the heck they're talking about in the article and we can all walk away a little bit smarter from it. Another awesome thing about these articles is that there's a comment section on every, like on every page. Every article has its own comment section at the bottom of the page. So if you feel like there was like one little detail that was left out of one of the articles on marijuanabreak.com, check the comment section down below at the, at the bottom of their articles so you can see if maybe somebody asked that question or said that thing. Something I love about the cannabis community is that so many people in this community like to share information with each other and it is kind of like a like an information sharing community because we don't all know everything about the plant we don't know everything about how each strain affects each person and there are strain reviews on this website too FYI but because everyone is so different and different cannabis strains products and just different cannabis stuff is probably gonna affect everybody a little bit differently I think it's always good to have sort of a community like atmosphere when we're learning about this stuff so it's nice I think to have a comment section and a community where people can discuss things which is one of the reasons why marijuana break is a great website to get your info from so it's no secret that I do my own reviews my own product reviews on this channel that's basically what my whole channel is but I really do think that marijuana break is a good website for my followers to get supplemental information things that can kind of uh, complement the research that I do for my videos and the information that I share in them so let's go on to marijuanabreak.com together and I will show you how I found some interesting articles from marijuanabreak.com. These articles are written in a way that almost anyone can understand. You don't have to be an expert to understand what the heck they're talking about in any of these articles because anytime that they talk about a specific topic in one of their articles, it seems like they pretty much always give you an awesome like intro and some background information about about the things they're going to be discussing in the article before you get into the meat of the conversation. Let's take a look and I'll give you an example of what I'm talking about. So we're gonna jump on to the old internet machine. I have my computer right here in front of me. So we're going to go on to marijuanabreak.com and check out some of their articles that I think that you guys will like. Okay, we're gonna hop on here, open up Google Chrome and Go to marijuanabreak.com. That's where we're going. Now, something I want to say up front, because you all, I don't need to tell you that I am a product junkie. I am someone who has specific products that they like, and I obsess over cannabis products, including CBD, THC products, whatever the case may be. 
I'm pretty picky about the things that I consume in general, but especially when it comes to cannabis. So our hemp or any number of different variations of the plant, but basically what I want to point out is I, I'm not, I don't, this isn't a bad thing necessarily, but on marijuanabreak.com there are a couple of different ads for CBD oil because their website, they have to make money somehow too. Marijuana Break has to make money somehow as a website. And it looks like one of the ways is to do ads for CBD brands. So I'm not saying that's bad and I'm not saying that the CBD oil brands are bad. I just have to say that I don't condone those products necessarily just because I don't have any experience with these particular brands that are being advertised. So keeping that in mind, just ignore their ads. I think the best way to find helpful information really is think about what it is that you're interested in learning about and use these links at the top of the page to navigate where you want to go and what you want to learn. There's articles about growing cannabis, which that's not legal in our state right now, so that would be difficult to do. But if you're interested in learning about that for the future, assuming that we will probably eventually have the legal opportunity to grow our own, or if you're just curious, because I know I'm always really curious about things that I'm not necessarily gonna actually act on, but I like reading about them anyway. So if you're like that, you can go to the growing section of the website, learn about growing different strains and different cannabis growing stuff. You can go to reviews and find reviews for different medical clinics, different CBD products, vape products, dispensaries. I didn't see any Florida dispensaries when I was on here before, so keep coming to me for that. But, but don't forget the more tab. This has the recipes link. This site has cannabis brownie recipes, cannabis butter, how to infuse your coconut oil with cannabis. A lot of different recipes that I have not done at all on my channel yet. Once again, I've only done my gummies video. That's the only edible thing I've done yet on my channel. But this page is giving me a lot of inspiration and I'm thinking about trying a new cannabis recipe soon like it's been a while since I tried making brownies with THC in them so maybe soon I'll like maybe I'll try their recipe soon just to see how it goes or just some cannabis chocolates might be nice like that's seems like it would actually be pretty easy I guess the majority of the work would probably be just melting down your chocolate mixing in your cannabis product etc so what do you guys think should I try a new recipe on my channel soon a new cannabis recipe and what do you think it should be? Should it be like savory food? Because I see a lot of different like savory food item re recipes. Ooh, holiday cannabis recipes. That's cute. I mean, okay, listen, I know it's freaking, what is it, June? It's the dead of summer, but the holidays will eventually come in a long time. But I like to look ahead to those days because it's so freaking hot outside. But um, basically there was a link to, um, holiday cannabis stuff. I haven't really tried any savory cannabis uh, food item recipes. Like I love freaking, I love quiche. So if there's a freaking THC quiche recipe. Oh uh, yeah, I wanna eat that. <laughs> but yeah, this is great. I mean, I really feel like all of the different articles are written in a way that is step by step. It's kind of like how I do any of my, any of my videos that were like tutorials that involve any steps, like my gummies recipe video, for example. Um, I tried to make that one as easy to understand as possible with just enough information for you to understand what I'm talking about and different bullet pointed pieces of advice in there. So, and I really feel like if you like that style of video and if you like how my videos have been going lately, you'll probably like marijuanabreak.com and their articles and their videos. So whether you're a noob aka someone who's really new to the world of cannabis or maybe you've been around and you know you've been out here for a minute no matter the case it doesn't matter anyone can enjoy this website and i think it's a great supplemental resource of information and again something that i can't stress enough that i love is that that the readers of this website and visitors of any kind can add their own comments to the bottom of every article page so you still get that community sort of feel on this website. There's definitely a place for you to put your thoughts in. So so if you did stay with me during this video, I really appreciate it. Um, I know that it's different from my usual, but we will be back on track next time, I promise, which will be in a couple of days. So keep an eye out for my next video. I don't really have a set schedule. I don't want to guarantee anything, but it will be in a couple of days. If this wasn't your cup of tea, I understand, but again, it's kind of like the nature of of the beast like when you watch tv you have advertisements 
listen to the radio. What do you have? Advertisements. Mama had to make a buck. I'm hungry. My cat's hungry. We gotta eat. So I had to do a video like this. So, but like I said, I would never support or talk up a company that I don't truly believe in. So I believe in marijuanabreak.com. Everything about it seems really great. There is a great little article and video about how to get your medical marijuana card in Florida. So that's something I haven't really covered on my channel. So if it's something you're looking for, I can put my seal of approval on their video about that because I watched it and I feel like the video really breaks down the step-by-step -step process of how to get your medical marijuana card in Florida. So thank you all for watching and I will check, uh, what? <laughs> I will see you in the next video. So I hope you have a good day or night or evening or whatever it is and I will, I will see you next time. <laughs> I will see you next time. Alright, see you in a couple days. Bye!